Hey you guys, so today I wanted to do something really quick and easy. This is kind of like a tutorial for people who don't have time in the morning to do their makeup but they still want to look good. I did a voiceover for this video because I actually timed myself doing my makeup and it took me 10 minutes altogether to do it. So if you have 10 minutes to spare in your morning, you can put makeup on and look great. I recently had a job interview and one of the questions in the interview was if you had a client who was a busy mother who was working and taking care of her kids and all that and you don't really have time to put your makeup on. She asked me my advice for what I would recommend to her and I just kind of, it really got me thinking of what would I recommend to her? What would I tell her to use? So I really wanted to make this video for people who are looking for something quick and easy that still looks good. In this video, I do have my hair up in a towel because I just got out of the shower. I didn't realize how weird that was, so just disregard that. So if you want to see how I got this look, just keep watching. The first thing I did was prime my face. You can probably skip this step. There's a lot of tinted moisturizers and BB creams that have primers in them already. I'm just using a CC cream by Carol Baker and just uh, putting it all over my face. And then I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. You could even just use concealer by itself just to brighten up your face and cover up those dark circles. I know how hard it is to get enough sleep these days, so concealer is definitely not optional. I'm just blending that out with a brush. You can use a disposable cosmetic sponge and just dab it into your skin. And then I'm using my NYX HD powder to set my concealer. This is a really nice affordable powder and it's amazing for setting under eye concealer. Going in with my Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion just to prime my eyes and any primer will work for this step. I'm using my Studio On The Go Eyeshadow Palette and I'm just using the super light beige color. You can use anything that's close to the color of your skin tone just to cover up those little veins on your eyelids. This step is optional, I'm just using a light brown color to deepen up my crease. Just using my Hikari Black Eyeliner to line my waterline. I'm also going to be using this to tight line and then use it on the top of my lash line. to curl my lashes. I'm using my Smashbox Full Exposure Mascara. And then I'm just using it on my bottom lashes as well. Using my NYX Micro Brow Pencil, I'm just going to brush my brows up and then I'm going to fill in all the empty spaces. And then I'm going to use my Nivea Pearly Shine Lip Balm. This is a nice lip chop that has a pink shiny finish. So that's just 9 minutes so far and if you want to warm up your skin you can use uh, bronzer and just put it on the places that you would usually put bronzer um, on your jawline, under your cheekbones and on the sides of your forehead. And then I'm just going in with a blush and blending it out. And then I'm using my NYX Dewy Finish Setting Spray. And there you have it, 10 minutes. And then I just blow dried my hair. So this is the finished look. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my next video.